Hi guys. At this point, we're really finishing up uh, about two weeks of being physically isolated, um, people working at home, being at home, kids are out of school. And so at this point, um, it might not be the best thing for us to just sit and worry at home. Um, and at this point, maybe it's time to really shift gears and figure out, well, what are we going to do during the rest of this time? Um, however undetermined it is. And so maybe um, some of us have already binged watch uh, t some series and some TV and movies and, and that's okay but at some point that will become very boring um, either for yourself or maybe your kids. And so um, on that note it, it might not be the best thing as well if you're constantly watching the news and I'm very mindful and very careful over um, the years of not watching the news and monitoring what is really coming in because that really affects my my mind and my brain um, and my mood and so at the beginning you know I may have been watching a little bit more news than than normal um, just with everything coming in so quickly um, but as things were progressing I've really made a note to say okay I'm gonna check in once or twice throughout the day um, you know, once in the morning, one, once at night, um, to really just have an update of what's going on. And, and uh, you know, there's different apps out there or, or certain um, sources that uh, you may really just trust that you can just get a quick update and then, and then move along and, and move, move along with, uh, with your day. So it's a really great time to think about what are you going to do. And for some of us, there's so many ideas and I'd love for you to share. Maybe it's a great time to... Um, just slow down and I was talking to a friend the other day who's taking more naps and so not only are the naps uh, helping them just take and recharge their batteries but at the same time uh, maybe you've been just running on empty for a long time and now this is time for you to just take that that home vacation that break uh, to help recharge your battery batteries Maybe it's time for you to read some books um, instead of watch, uh, just watch TV. Uh, maybe it's uh, time for you to reevaluate your goals, your financial goals, your life goals. Um, what, are, what are goals that you would like to reach over the next um, you know, 5, 10, 20, 30 years? Um, because those goals will come. This, this all will come to an end. Um, and so you know, I'm going to encourage you not to be a hermit and to reach out to people and know that there might be people out there that aren't as connected as you are, but might need a, a, a reach out and say, hey, don't forget, I'm here for you. And so even on that note, you're welcome to invite some, some friends and family to the group so that we can all really come together and support each other. I was, um, there's so many virtual, I was talking to a friend and there's so many virtual things out there they had watched, um, they had gone to a, a virtual museum um, in France and I thought, wow, that's, a, that's an awesome idea and you can just Google things to do during a, a quarantine um, and find ideas for yourself and for your, for your kids, uh, for your friends. Um, so I would love for you to just, let's just post below one or two things um, that people may not think about what to do during this time um, or where to find some resources. Um, let's just stay connected and help each other and uh, yeah, share some ideas below.